Today we're going to be solving this geometry problem where we're looking for the, the area of the square around the outside, the area of the circle in the center, and we're also going to find the area of this region up here in the top right section of the shape. So let's get started. So we're going to start with finding the area of the circle. Okay, so as we know, the area of a circle equals pi r squared. And in this case, we know the diameter of the circle because of the 16 centimeters down here. So I'm going to pull this circle out here to the right side, and we know the diameter of this circle is 16 centimeters. So the diameter is twice the radius, and we know that 16 centimeters is twice of the radius, and then that means that r must equal 8 centimeters. So this here is 8 centimeters. All right, so we have the radius over here, and now we can plug this into our area equation to find the area of the circle. So a equals pi times 8 squared, and this comes out to 201.06 centimeters squared. Okay, now let's find the area of the square around the outside. So the area of a square is a equals base times height. And in this case, you know, the base is 16 centimeters, and the height is also 16 centimeters since this is a square. And this comes out to 256 centimeters squared. So this is the area of the square. So now we need to find the area of the shaded region up here in the top right corner. And to do this, if we take a look at our diagram, we can see that the total area of those shaded regions would be the area of the square minus the area of the circle because these are the blank spaces around the outside and this will give us the total area of these small spaces around the outside of the circle. Think of it like we're removing the area of the circle from the area of the square. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to do area of the square 256 centimeters squared minus the area of the circle 201.06 centimeters squared and this equals 54 0.94 centimeters squared. But we have a problem. This is the total area of the outside sections here in our shape. We just want one of the corner regions here. So the nice thing about a square is you can divide this up into four even pieces, and each piece is representative of one quarter of the total area of the square. So to find the shaded region, we can just take our total area of all the corners and divide that by 4, because that's 1 quarter of the square. So let's do 54.92 times 1 quarter, because it's just 1 quarter of the shape. And this is going to give us 13.73 centimeters squared. And this is the area of the shaded region in our shape.